In this video, I'll be unboxing and reviewing the Infrared P2 Pro Thermal Camera, one of the smallest infrared camera attachments for smartphones. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe and follow me on Twitter so you'll be notified once I upload a new video. And if you need any tools, there are links in the description. Alright, let's go ahead and unbox this. We got a nice carrying pouch. And some manuals. Now here's the camera itself. Here's an additional magnetic zoom lens that attaches over the camera. Now this is an extension cable. You can use this cable to attach one end to the phone and the other end to the camera. So this way you can extend the camera and make it more versatile and use it in places without having to move your phone around, so it's more convenient. As for the measurements on the camera, it's 27 millimeters long, by 18 millimeters, and it's about nine millimeters thick. On this lens attachment, there's a cover that can be removed. and attaches over with a magnet. When the thermal camera is not being used, you can store it in the pouch provided to carry it around with you in your pocket. First, the P2 Pro app will need to be downloaded and installed from either the Play Store or the App Store. The P2 Pro comes in two versions, one for Android and one for iPhones. The one I have is an Android version which connects to the phone with the USB-C port. The version for the iPhone will of course connect with the Lightning port. Now due to the fact that newer generation iPhones starting with the iPhone 15 will be coming with USB-C ports, it would be safe to assume that the Android version of the P2 Pro should work fine with both Android phones that have USB-C charger ports, as well as iPhone 15 models and newer. So taking a look at the app, we have the gallery over here for pictures or videos you already took. And we have different palettes we can choose from. We're currently on Rainbow 3, but there is Rainbow 1, Rainbow 2, there's Iron Red, White Hot, and a few other ones we can select from. You can take both pictures and video with the P2 Pro, or use it just to find heat signatures. You can also select to flip it between 90, 180, and 270 degrees. So it's really convenient in allowing you to customize the angles of the camera. There's also variable correction, and different modes we can select from between high image quality or a wider range. The app also allows you to adjust the brightness or contrast. 
In the settings, we also have an option for professional thermometry, advanced image setting, temperature setting, and general. Also, there's a help section. So you could change the units between Celsius or Fahrenheit, as well as Kelvin. You can set to have a high temp alarm, as well as a low temp alarm. You can also set the value at which you want the alarm to go off at. Another option you have is to use the picture-in-picture, -picture, which allows you to turn on the cameras on your phone, either the back ones or the front ones. So that's another useful feature. There's also a calibration button on the top right. Here's a look with the provided zoom lens. So it provides a little bit of zoom. The compact size of this camera makes it useful to carry it on the go in your pocket, so you'd be able to use it when you need. Whether you're going hiking, hunting, or your job at hand requires you to find heat sources, this small thermal camera will do the job. Even contractors or people with DIY or do-it-yourself projects can make use of such a tool in many instances. From HVAC to floor heating, plumbing to electrical equipments or jobs, and even for engineers and repairs. This camera can be used to detect shorts or problem points on motherboards or electrical components. I really like the fact that there's an extension cable, so you can use the camera at different angles without having to move the actual phone around. And there's also a lot of different options on the app itself, which lets you customize the camera to work better for you for the type of application you're using it for. This sort of thermal camera attachment is beneficial due to the fact you can attach it and use it on almost any smartphone that doesn't have a thermal camera built in. So you won't need to carry a separate bulky camera around with you. I'll place links in the description if you're interested in purchasing one of these, and I'll see you in the next video.